before the fall season. Give McCarthy Tire a call. They're open tomorrow till 3 o'clock on a Saturday. Here is Apatiki, gives it to his running back, and it is taping on his feet. Touch me down goes Parker Ballesta on his first touch of the night from seven yards. Ballesta headed to Stony Brook and a score me in the first quarter. Let's head down to the sideline and Nate Johns. Yeah, so the touchdown run there from Dallas by Parker Ballesta. Parker's a Stony Brook commit. All District 2 defensive lineman. One of the most impactful players for Dallas on both sides of the ball, and he's showing why there. John will send back up to you. 108 on the clock. Jopiak, the hold coming by Peter. Kick is up, it's got plenty of distance, and it is good. 10 to zip for the Dallas Mountaineers. Let's head down to the sideline, and Nate Johns has some info for us. All right, so a big play there from Abington, and a big play is on the drive to hold him to a field goal with a big sack there by Austin Borsma, who had three sacks last year for Abington, and is still obviously one of the best players they have on their defense. John, will send it back up to you. Thank you very much, Nate. Good job. So here is Hartshorn from 25 yards out. Snap, a kick, it is blocked by Pacheski. Pacheski on the blocker, he picks it up. And he gets all the way down to the 45 yard line. Pacheski, we got a flag on the field. But how about Pacheski coming off the edge execute with all those 11 guys. Mark Shore, and I'd like to see him maybe try a, a big long run. 38 seconds on the clock here in the first half. Dallas leads by 10. Gonna have a real different feel to this second half. Theodore's going up top, he's got his dude. It's not Paul Crew, it's intercepted. They try to go to Fedor, and it's caught by Turpak. He's got a contingency down in the Abington Heights territory. And they're going to celebrate as Abington. And our student reporter, Nate Johns, is down on the sidelines. He's got head coach Rich Manello getting ready for the second half. Right, so we're down here with Coach Manello from Dallas. Coach Manello, what are your thoughts on the first half? Well, we got some self-inflicted wounds, and uh, we got to take care of that. Made some big plays. Got to sustain drives. Got to stay out of long yardage. All right, they got some great skill kids, so we got to do up, play our brand of football, and get it done here in the weight room for the second half. All right, coach, thank you very much. Good luck with the second half. Ballesta left-hand side. He's got an entourage over there. Parker Ballesta down the sideline. He goes. They got an angle on him. He's got one to beat. He's going to take it to the house. Covers 66 yard touchdown. Parker Ballesta, score me. Blitz is coming. They pick it up, right hand side. Ballesta's got plenty of wiggle room. He's down the sideline. You ain't gonna tackle muscle. 34 yard touchdown, John. Parker Ballesta putting the game on his shoulders right now. Theodore. He's going to keep it himself. It looks that way he does. Does the ball get over? The ball is still in the air. And touchdown, Theodore. And they come it to Abington Heights. Zapatiki, score me. Pacheski. How about that right to start quarter number four? Zapatiki goes end zone on the post pattern. And Pacheski wide open for the 29th point for the Dallas Mountaineers. Backfield here for Dallas. Left-hand side, it is Parker Ballesta. Parker Ballesta breaks a tackle. He's still on his feet. Parker Ballesta's got a guy to beat. He's going to get a tackle or a blocker down there. He beats somebody. Flag on the field. Who's it going to go against? Does he make it 88 yards? They'll cool off. So we can cool about five hot days, and then we'll cool off. Lewis, right side, following his blocking, following his heart, following it into the end zone. Touchdown, Dallas. So 7-16 on the clock for this one. High backfield. 
25 seconds. They give it to the fullback, and he scores. Touchdown, Abby tonight with 19 seconds to go. Down there on the sidelines is a junior. Wants to get into broadcasting, and uh, he's well on his way. Wants to head to Syracuse. He's doing a, a bang-up job down there. 